I am top Central Florida realtor, Scott Garrison. Right there, we are looking at Holm City Road, vacant land here in Haines City, Florida, 33844. And the purpose of this video is to give you a feel for the lot, the area, this is to give you a feel for what it's really like. We're on Polk City Road, which is a busy road, but that property goes way back, as you'll see, so you won't be on the road here. 4067 Polk City Road is a good way to find it. And that's 4083 Polk City Road right there. Best I can determine, right about that vacant tree. Right about here. Go right out there, straight, and that's the right side of this lot. I've just put some blue painter's tape on that. You might be able to see in this video in the distance. And then the size of this lot is half the size of this lot, which goes from there to way over there. So now we're going up to 4083 Polk City Road. For the best I can determine, the double lot for this home ends right about there. So we're gonna go about halfway in between. We got right about to there. So if you look right about there, there's some blue tape on that right center screen right there. And that should be the left side of the lot. It goes quite a ways back there to the water. All right, another way to place it. I'm gonna say right here about the middle of the lot. It's about right there in the house. Which is about right there where this pole this is a lakefront lot, 1.56 acres. Taxes are only $880 last year. And we're gonna walk along down the left-hand side. We won't be able to get to the water, but I will edit in some drone footage of the water so you can see what it looks like when we go all the way back. The property is dry. I went back almost to the lake until I got stuck in the woods. I do see a little center right about there with some maple trees, which usually is a little lower spot, but what do you expect? It's right up on the lake, so we'd have to get an exact topographical survey to know exactly where we could build and where we can't. But all of this, you'll see, is dry as we can be, and we've had some rain recently. So for anyone who's going to build out here, you're going to build a pretty substantial size house on this. It's going to be a lakefront house. I have some examples either here or if you Google the address, Zero Polk City Road, Realtor Scott Garrison, I'll get some pictures of the neighbor's houses to pull up and show you as well. That's just for me walking back here. This is definitely not light traversing back here. This is raw land. It's definitely buildable. And I put some blue tape there. There's some pink tape there and then way in the distance right where i'm pointing there's a bush with a little bit of pink tape there but that's too far over when i'm looking at the plat map to be our lot so that must be the edges of the lot so we're somewhere in here and i know it sounds flippy but if you care exactly where we're at on the land where your house is going to be you, you, you can't figure it, it doesn't even matter Back here, no neighbors. The survey company will mark it exactly. And somewhere right in there is about where the house will go. You can see those are all pines, which means it's dry. Starting to get some maple right there. Again, what do you expect? You're on the lake. And then just right over that, just right over that, is the water. Definitely going to need to clear it. You can make it as open or as not open as you'd like. This will be the property to the side of yours, to the south. We're about 20% towards the front now. We started off right there. Your house would be somewhere right in here. If you're even looking for a vacant land out here or anywhere in Central Florida, I want you to call me. Top Central Florida Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. I've been listing and selling home and vacant land like this every day, full time. Day in and day out for 32 years. I sold thousands of homes. Chances are, I can help you too. Back out at the road again. I guessed about there as the line. 
It's an old barbed wire fence right there. Give you a context for where we are. There's that power pole with the yellow plastic wrappers just a little bit over here. You can see the dog fennel right here growing up. And I'm guessing that this fence was not put here by accident many years ago. You have to really look. But if you look behind there, you're going to start to see all along here a post and an old barbed wire fence. And that's probably the actual, I was guessing right about there. I was just a couple of feet off. Again, one of the reasons why I'm doing this is people are going to call and say, where's the land? That was my guess for the closest tree. 15 feet to the left is the remains of that barbed wire fence. And that's probably the actual, your house, would almost for sure, you could almost drive back here. Notice how nice and dry it is. Your house is going to be past those dead trees there, I imagine. Want to get as close to the lake as you can. It's far away from the traffic. Got these nice trees that you can leave here forever. Give you a good buffer. That nice Florida feeling.